With more than 400 students from 49 countries and 32 states, the Genius Olympiad is not your average science fair. It's neat to see students from all these countries all working on the same projects. This year, those projects all focus on environmental issues. The students were selected from more than 600 applicants to present their work to judges who say the projects are exceeding expectations. These are high school students who are doing the work of college graduates. And so college graduates, you know, are very cerebral folks, but this is uh, what they're doing here is fantastic. One of this year's standouts, Maeve Harris, a high school freshman from Washington State, has designed a new wind turbine blade. I designed these blades using biomimicry, which is looking at patterns and sequences commonly found in nature and using them to make our industrialized world more efficient. The verdict? Judges say her idea could someday change the industry, but Harris's goal is much more simple. One thing that um, inspires me the most is helping the environment because our world is in such crisis with many problems and I feel like anything that I can do to help would be a great achievement. By bringing so many different students together, organizers say this event is the ideal forum for students to exchange what they've learned about science, but the students themselves say the most important lessons here are about something else altogether. It's, it's different, but it's really amazing. It's really amazing to talk with, with Paul, of, I don't know, from Kosovo, from the other, the other continent. It's really interesting, and also it's really, it's a good experience. I think that is the best experience of my life. Experiences these students will carry with them long after returning home. In Oswego, Candace Hopkins, YNN.